What's going on, baseball fans? Jimmy Laracuente here for the Baseball Banter Broadcast, continuing our series here on this broadcast, bringing you the ultimate five-tool player for each and every team in Major League Baseball. Today, the team that we are going to be bantering about is the Cleveland Guardians. Now, before we get into it, we're going to go over exactly what is a five-tool player, followed by the contact tool. Now, for those that may not know, the five tool player encompasses five different skills, and it is listed out as contact, power, speed, arm, and fielding. So in order for us to create the ultimate five tool player, we have to put together five players to equal out this tool set. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to make it five individual players and not double up on any one specific player. So with that in mind, we're gonna begin with contact. Now the contact tool for the Cleveland Guardians is without question the perennial MVP, Jose Ramirez. I think that when you look at what this player is capable of doing, he is a number of these potential tool assets. But most importantly, this is a player that puts the bat on the ball. And I think for that reason, it is smart and a wise decision to be able to name Jose Ramirez as the contact tool for the Cleveland Guardians. This is a player that, as I said, is perennially in the MVP conversation and for good reason. And I think that when you look at what Ramirez means to the Guardians and their success, there's no doubt about it as to why he is one of the very premier assets in Major League Baseball. And for that reason, we're going to put him as the contact tool. When it comes to the power tool for the Guardians, this was something that they were lacking in 2022. So they went out and acquired Josh Bell to be able to be a part of that newly revamped power structure for their lineup. There's no doubt about it that the switch hitter is capable of being a huge presence in the middle of any order, but especially for these Cleveland Guardians who were without power really in 2022. So I think that for the Guardians, bringing Josh Bell in was a wise investment and that's why we name him the power tool. And when it comes to the speed tool for the Cleveland Guardians, there are a number of players that it could have been, but we're going to go with Andres Jimenez. And I think that when you look at what Jimenez provides the Guardians, it is quite high quality base running, but also a guy who can steal some bases and not just with reckless abandon, but he picks and chooses his spots in very good opportunities. I also think that there's an opportunity for him to continue to develop his overall game and use that speed as an asset. So for this list, we're going to be naming Andres Jimenez as the speed tool. Now, when it comes to grading out the arm tool, there's no doubt about it. Oscar Gonzalez is the arm that stands out in this Guardians lineup. When you look at the throws that he is capable of making from the outfield, there's no doubt about it. This is one of the more dynamic throwing arms in Major League Baseball. The other thing about Gonzalez is, is that when you look at his stat cast numbers, there's no doubt why he's on this list as the arm tool. When you look and compare his average velocities with the rest of his teammates, I think that there's no doubt about it. This is the player that is continuing to grow and improve and really start to mature in his approach at the plate. But no doubt when you look at what his already built in assets are, having that cannon for an arm is really a powerful asset for the Guardians. Now, when we round out looking at the fielding tool, there are very few players in Major League Baseball as highly gifted and talented defensively as Miles Straw. That is his main asset for the Guardians, is his defensive ability. This is a player that has struggled offensively and likely will continue to kind of slowly develop that offensive progression and maybe never even get to a place where you can consider him well above league average. But when you add in his defense, this is a player that is extremely valuable to the Cleveland Guardians and their overall attack for the 2023 season. So very little question, the fielding tool for the Guardians 
is Miles Straw. But I want to hear from you. Let me know, Guardians fans, how are you feeling about your team and their chances in 2023? How would you craft the ultimate five-tool player using the 2023 roster for the Cleveland Guardians? Let me know these things down in the comment section below or find me over on Twitter at banter underscore baseball. We can keep the conversation rolling on crafting the ultimate five-tool player from the 2023 Guardians. You can find more from our social media outlets on Instagram and TikTok at Baseball Banter Broadcast. You can also head over to LaDaQuintaLetter.com where there is a corresponding article up on this very video as we speak. And last but certainly not least, if you want to show us some support here, you can head over to our merchandise shop, BaseballBanterBroadcast.com where we have a ton of promo codes and things you can use to save on some banter merch to be able to rep the channel. And speaking of representing the channel, if you haven't already and you're loving the content that you're seeing here, hit that subscribe button and the bell for post notifications. Most of our audience is not yet subscribed to this channel. So as we continue to try to build out this baseball community, hitting the subscribe button down below truly helps us do so in a very, very big way. So I want to thank you and I will catch you on the next broadcast when we banter about baseball. Peace.